Well, Fast and Furious star Tyrese Gibson. <laughs> he can play it smooth and slow since his hit, How You Gonna Act Like That. <laughs> and now he's back with a brand new album called Black Rose. <laughs> Please welcome back Tyrese Gibson. <laughs> Just before we start, <laughs> before we start, I know you were looking for your phone. Here it is. <laughs> and here the album. Oh. <laughs> and the selfies that are on there. Oh. <laughs> if you look at them really close, you can tell what's what. Oh! <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> So, so you just put my business in the street then. That's what you mean. That's what you mean. No, I put my business on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> See, he never thinks of me like that, so I can't even clown with him, because he's like, please, I know you didn't do that. <laughs> but the new album, Black Rose, is out today, and you keep saying this is going to be your last solo album. <laughs> Baby. Why is this your last album? Isn't there, aren't there more musical uh, genres for you to conquer? I just feel like, I feel like we need to make a statement this time. I need some inspiration to keep going. You know, right now, if you think about it, mm -hmm. way back when, when we fell in love with R&B soul music, mm -hmm. for the real fans of R&B, this mm -hmm. genre, it was never Luther Vandross featuring Curtis Blow. It was never Marvin Gaye featuring Run DMC. <laughs> so a lot of the R&B singers are either out of a deal, or don't have a deal at all because everything is about twerking and turning up and doing all the other stuff. So, you know, I feel like, I feel like. But then why give it up? Why not take it back? Well, I need a reason to stay. You know, no Please. one's no one's gonna like can put I, that can much. Can I give you a reason to stay? Tell me. Because you, no, no, seriously, because you do it well, and everything. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. And everything is cyclical. It yeah. always goes around, and this will always be. You know, we have rap now. It started with Louis Jordan in the 30s. We always see music come back. Never give up on the music, because you do it well, and it's yours, and you can't stop. And, the, and the reason you do it well... Hey, that, was, that, was, that was my mama coming down on me. Right <laughs> Look at those pictures. The reason you do it well, Tyrese, is because you know what's supposed to be put into an album. You know that it's character, I mean, artist development. You know that you have to put your heart and soul into it. And you said you did a lot of that with this album. It took me three and a half. I mean, on a metaphor level, think of it as like a three and a half year pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Like creative, oh. creative pregnancy. Oh. That was every <laughs> complication imaginable <laughs> right. I went through. Right. Like, right. you know, and because money is not the motivation, it's like really being committed to the craft. It's like, you come out here and you put this album out and you're trying to figure out what can you say mm -hmm. that can make real fans of buying whole albums decide, today, mm -hmm. I'm going to the store to buy this full album mm -hmm. to keep R&B music alive. Yeah. Like, that's a big deal. Yeah. You know it what I'm saying? Deal. So, you know, Black I, Rose is my baby. I it's put... your baby, and you, let me tell you something. <sighs> Go ahead. You know, she said, she said that, you know, the reasons everything is cyclical and, and you have your craft, but another reason for you to stick I'll give you two more reasons. One, you can sing your ass off, okay? And you're right. A lot of people can't sing um, that are out there today. Um, and, but also, did you see them screaming when you came out? Well, and now... I, I never said I was gonna quit music as a whole. I just said that this is my last solo album. 
Okay. That's that's what I'm saying. Okay, so good. So we'll get over Black to Rose Jesus. is my baby. All right. So let's and let's let's talk about Shame then, your new single. Okay. So cuz yeah, now now we're going to calm down cuz we got mad that you said okay. you were going to yeah, go I away. Felt it. It was, I felt okay. it. Was real. All right. Now you made a music video out of your new single Shame. Yes. Right? And you it's also It's a movie. It's a short film. A short film, film starring Jennifer Hudson yes. and it was produced by Denzel Washington? Yes. Yeah. Oh my god. But did you take your shirt off in it? Do we get to see your abs? Oh, my, That's... Shirt, my shirt is not off in this. I'm okay. so sorry. Um, <laughs> but listen, if you love the movie Dream Girls or the movie yeah. Ray, we wanted to tap into that period, 1968. That's the same year that Dr. King was assassinated. Mm -hmm. So supposedly this movie happened like eight months before the assassination. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm a singer in a pub. Jennifer is my wife. I'm on drugs, alcohol. Um, it's like a classic case of becoming powerful and becoming abusive with your power. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's who I am in this movie. And it's a short film that's 25 minutes long, so we want to be in a couple of short film festivals around November and hopefully land an Oscar. Wow. <laughs> and another movie. Um, obviously, we all love you from Fast and Furious. Is there going to be an eighth Fast and Furious, and will you be in it, please? Number eight is definitely <laughs> happening, and I'm definitely looking at the world. you guys how long I've known you. I've known you since I was 12 in, years in old. In utero. Wow. Since I was 12 years old, I remember, can I just say it? I remember um, when he was singing on the bus for Pepsi. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Sorry, Coke. Cool. It's all right. Sorry. It's all right. You got it's off right. the bus and walked on the stage of Hang With Mr. Cooper. Yes. And everybody on the set, Holly Robinson, Mark Curry, everybody was like, who is this man? What is going on? And to see you now is it makes me feel old for the first time. Just seeing a progression of someone and still stay humble and still get your work together and still go through so many amazing movies that bless and, and nurture other talent is heaven for me. Thank you. Bless you, well, you just bless you me. just brought up a good point. Well, you know, why don't we why don't we play that? The Coca-Cola commercial. say this because this is very important to be able to have a 30 second commercial to turn into 20 years of some form of show business mm -hmm. can only be God's favor mm -hmm. only be God's favor and thank you thank you I think I want to say this because again I know I'm here to talk about Black Rose and all of the other stuff but there's so many people looking at this I want you to understand that what you're going through right now is a season, and the outcome of that season through determination, you'll get to the other side. The start right. of what you're dealing with right now will not dictate the outcome of what your life and career is destined to be. So stay in it, stay on your path, and you'll get there. Yeah. Blime to the ridiculous and ask you to take a selfie with us. You have 30 million followers and we're dying oh, to be can on I see your, your followers. Can we? I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> can we all do Let's that? Do it. Let's come do it. Let's go. Bring it in. We're going to outdo okay. Ellen on this. Okay. 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 We're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're in Ellen, Ellen competition. Ellen, Ellen ain't Ellen. ready. Ellen ain't ready. One, two. Ah. There we go. date recently because you have a, 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 a there's a new ride a thrill ride for the fast and furious supercharge that opened at universal and, and I, you took I a brought, really special my, date there I brought my lady out to the red carpet with oh. me yes absolutely there she is. Oh. <laughs> that's my baby she is my hero that is my black rose. That is my black love rose, it. my little love angel. It. I love her. Well, this is your little black whoopie saying. 